Welcome to the installation video of CVI, my procedural material for Blender. Before we start, be sure you have downloaded CVI and unzipped the zip file into your preferred folder. We will use the folder later to append the material. Because CVI is not a regular add-on for Blender, uh, instead it's a material tree, you have to append this material into your existing scene. How to do this, I will show you now. I have a fresh scene here in Blender. There is no object in, in the scene. And we can append now the material to this scene. The same will happen if you are using an existing scene with a character, for example, and you want to use CVI in your scene. So to append the material, you go to File here and go to Append. And you can use, if you like, the Shift F1 shortcut to do this too. After clicking on Append, you go to the folder where you have extracted the zip file of CVI. The content there is a folder called Examples, where you find some render examples of CVI, and the current CVI version. It's this blend file here. You click on the blend file and you see the scene hierarchy of this file. So you see all the content that is included in the blend file. So what we see here is a material folder. This folder is containing the CVI materials. We click on the material. Now we see all the content in this folder and you see my presets I have prepared for you to use them in your own projects. I choose CVI Ocean for example. Then I go to here append from library and click on this button. Now the material is included in my new scene here. We don't see it because there is no object that can be using, that can use this material. So to do this, I add a small sphere here and make it a bit more high resolution and make it smoothie. This sphere have to be our eye for our example. Now I open a render box and switch on the preview and you see it's a bit dark, so I make it a bit brighter and I make the lamp like a sun, so we see a little bit more here. Then I choose my sphere that have to be the eye and choose my appended material. To do this you go to the properties and then you go to materials and there you see there is no material existing at the moment. So here on this object. So to choose the appended material, you just go here into the material browser icon and you see the material is existing in our scene, but it's not added to any object. So this is the reason for the zero number here. Now I choose the CVI Ocean material and it will be automatically added here into our scene. Now we can use the material and change all the options for our own needs. Of course, you can use the note tree here if you like to. So to do this, you go just here, open the window and switch to the note editor. And uh, then you see the material tree here and you can choose and uh, alter the options if you like to. So you see, it's very easy to append the CVI material into ex an existing or fresh scene. So thank you for watching and have fun with my material tree. Bye bye.